stuff that I left wedged it on there and it worked, but it's all We're here, Team Rescue. Look at my new pit beagle, baby. Good morning, round three. Typical taxi garage. Good morning, round three. Round three. Round three, we're going into the championship, uh, like 40 something points behind first through this lane. Uh, we're gonna just go have fun. Um, Ryan's already had an eventful uh, last few weeks, but it seems like the car is together and he's persevered. My car is in one piece, so we're gonna try to keep it that way. Obviously, the bank can eat people up. And again, we're gonna have fun. So, um, gotta go out to practice. Wait, I'm, sure. wait, I missed the whole install? Yeah, I know. We We've done it so many times now, I'm too quick at it. Here we are, bro. Round something something of USDC. And my car's an absolute nightmare since the new build. Just a myriad of issues. And uh, last night we went to load the car in the trailer and the alternator caught on fire and started melting. So I think it was the issue from the, the private day that we did just a week and a half ago where the car caught on fire, the alternator was in the fire, I tried to run it still and hope it was still good, and of course, it was bad. So, here I am, thanks to King's performance, last night on the way up, I messaged Willie, and he sourced me an alternator and brought it to the track today, I love you dog, thank you so much, huge shout out to King's performance, but uh, we're back here today, the car's got 14 volts with everything on board, and we're ready to send it, let's go.
feeling good? I'm feeling good, very calm, relaxed. That's where we need to be. We're in a good spot. We've been dying on the car. We got the new BC Racing suspension on the car. But these are off the shelf BC Racing coilovers on the car right now. And uh, honestly, they're, they're working. They're, they feel really good. Running a Tire Streets Accelera 651 in a 200 tread wear. We went back down to a 265. And my car doesn't make the power on the bank. Kind of fighting to keep the car up on the bank without having too much grip, while also not getting left by the fast cars. So. Looking, it feels decent. Um, there's definitely four or five guys that we need to worry about. Uh, I think with last week's uh, practice session with Rad Dan really, really helped the timing and just muscle memory, because that's really what this is about. Especially in the chase position, you're gonna be smoked out, so you just need to be able to count one, two, one, two, and hit your marks. One, two, one, two. So uh, we're gonna change these acceleras and then uh, we go to qualifying. So we're second in points. So we go second to last. So we got four laps on this tire. Uh, 651, 200 tread wear. Dialed pretty good. Uh, it looks like it could actually have a little more tire pressure, but we're okay without that. We got four laps, which is better than normal, but it's also not a fair comparison because they were spread out between cars crashing and oil and the tire cooling down. All right, we're gonna go put a new set on and then um, make sure we get a bunch of, we're gonna put a bunch of heat in these when we do qualify. Um, I feel really good actually. The car is not catching on fire. That was the number one concern today. There's still a bunch of other things to fix and dial in for the future, but overall the car's shredding and I'm very thankful to be out here with the team. Conservative, good qualifying run. Didn't try to burn the world down, and I completed the lap, and that's where we need to be. So what I get, Charlie? Strategically, 74. Put himself strategically in the bracket. That's what the boy did. He knows his game. To calm down with the alcohol. It's five o'clock somewhere.
Jamie, let's go! Jamie! Come on, champ. Jam, jam,
scale. That was amazing. That's the best time of my life, man. That was awesome. Yeah. That was amazing. Best time of my life. But, uh, yeah, you know, glad you enjoyed it. And obviously, yeah, I can't thank you enough so much. Of course. Well, I can probably go back to that same thing. Can't thank you enough, right? You dedicated a bunch of your life to do something that I'm way too much of a bitch to do. So I'm going to fucking thank you. So there you go. Good man. I appreciate it. Absolutely.